and gentlemen, it's time to talk more wrestling. Ah, oh, the fucking wrestling, huh? There you go, WrestleMania in two weeks. Have to talk a little wrestling till Mania. But if Mania sucks, if it's horrible, we'd be fucking done with wrestling officially. For fuck's sakes, especially if I have to pay huge money to watch it on TV and Americans get it for 10 bucks. You know, it's a bit insulting, so the shit better be good or else I'm fuck out officially. Officially, huh? It's like my atheism. <laughs> it's official. Uh, all those dislikes. <laughs> dislikes, hundred something dislikes, huh? Got my people. Let's <laughs> talk some fucking wrestling. Triple H against Daniel Bryan. A um, couple of things I don't like from this match. Number one, you know, they have to use Bryan twice in one night just to fill up Mania. How weak is it? You know, they bring back <laughs> Batista. That doesn't compare to The Rock or something like this. Batista and Orton, we don't even know who they're facing for the fucking title. What kind of build is that? It's just like some kind of leftover match. They have to use Brian twice because they have no but to fill up fucking names. How sad is that, okay? Another thing I don't like, Daniel Bryan, the hottest guy in wrestling. Not set well sexually too there, but the most popular guy in wrestling currently. And Triple H, you know, wrestles Brian. Why? Triple H is done. He's supposed to be, you know, the COO now. He's not wrestling every week. He's not busting his ass. Why the fuck is he fighting the most popular guy in wrestling today? Makes no sense to me. Brian should be in the one-on-one -on -one match for the world title. It should be promoted properly. The fuck is this Triple H garbage? It seems like a very greedy move by Triple H to take the hottest star in wrestling and taking advantage of that, taking the popularity and putting it on himself. So that he can get over as a heel or whatever. It's just greed. He doesn't deserve to fight at Mania after doing nothing all year. Oh, he's the COO. It was all given to him because he had sex with a woman. That's it. Here's a job. Here's the McMahon wannabe position on TV. But where does he truly deserve wrestling-wise, to be fighting the best at Mania. Doesn't deserve it, so... Those are my main complaints with the match. Um, it might turn out to be a good match. Bret Hart said that Triple H never had a great match. Well, this might be it. No thanks to Triple H, but because of Brian. Brian makes every wrestler look good. Him against Bray Wyatt. It turned out to be an epic match. All because of Brian and his talent. So he could, you know, do the same shit. Make Triple H look like he had a great match. But really, it's all Brian doing the work. And, you know, it's pretty obvious that Brian's going to win. That's, you know, another complaint about the match. Pretty obvious. I don't see Triple H beating him. That would be asking for it way too much. You know, Triple H out of nowhere fighting Brian. Imagine him actually winning <laughs> and fighting for the belt when he's supposed to be the COO for fuck's sakes. You know, maybe that way Batista would get cheered by default against Triple H and Orton, but... Hopefully, that's not what they're going for. You know, I'm pretty sure Brian is going to win. Then he's going to fight in the main event. Triple H fighting in two matches after doing shit. You know, that would just be wrong. That would be sacrilegious or whatever. 
That happens, that is concrete proof that there's no fucking God or whatever. But match could end up being good. Hopefully, Brian's gonna win. He'll win, people. If not, I'm fucking done. Done with wrestling. If Brian does not win both matches, he has to beat Triple H and win the world title, or else I am done. Completely done. I don't give a fuck if Sting comes out the next night on Raw. That's probably gonna be their hook. You know, to fucking sucker us in to watch another year of this shit. It's gonna be Sting. <laughs> the Stinker on Raw. That's what it's gonna be. And if Brian does not win, I will not watch Sting on Raw. I will force myself not to watch it straight up. If Brian does not walk out with the belt, I'm done. If Triple H wins, this would be disgusting and shameful on WWE's part. All right, till next time, peace.